Ephesians chapter 4, verse 1 through 16. As a prisoner for the Lord, then I urge you to live a life worthy of the calling you have received. Be completely humble and gentle. Be patient, bearing with one another in love. Make every effort to keep the unity of the Spirit through the bond of peace. There is one body and one Spirit, just as you were called to one hope when you were called. One Lord, one faith, one baptism, one God and Father of all, who is over all and through all and in all. But to each one of us, grace has been given as Christ apportioned it. That is why it said, when he ascended on high, he led captives in his train and gave gifts to men. What does he ascended mean, except that he also descended to the lower earthly regions? He who descended is the very one who ascended higher than all the heavens in order to fill the whole universe. It was he who gave some to be apostles, some to be prophets, some to be evangelists, and some to be pastors and teachers to prepare God's people for works of service so the body of Christ may be built up Next phrase. Until we, Until we all reach unity of the faith and the knowledge of the Son of God and become mature, attaining to the whole measure of the fullness of God. Then we will no longer be infants, blow, uh, tossed back and forth by the waves and blown here and there by every wind of teaching and by the cunning and craftiness of men in their deceitful scheming. Instead, speaking the truth in love, we will all in all things grow up into Him who is the head, that is Christ, and be... Be, from him that is Christ from him the whole body joined and held together by every uh, by every supporting ligament grows and builds itself up in love as each part does its work